hi guys my name is mustafa and today in my video i'm going to show you that how can you guys upgrade your office pc to a gaming pc so as you can see i'm using a dell optiplex 3080 uh, and it is a i5 intel core i5 10th gen pc okay uh, there are two simple usb port and two usb 0 3.0 a headphone jack and a power button and a cd drive as you can see and optiplex 3080 written over here so at the side so let me just show you from inside how does this look so this is like this okay so this is the cpu cooler and uh, under this there is our i5 10500 processor and with the 8, 4 gb of ram as you can see this stick is a 4 gb of ram 266 memory megahertz 4 gb and i have added an additional of an 250 gb of ssd it's a lexer ssd m2 uh, and i have downloaded my windows in this and there is one tb of hard drive which comes with it okay so now to upgrade this we need two to three things first of all we need our graphic card so as you can see i am using a gtx 1650 graphic card it's a gddr6 memory 4 gigabytes and i'm using my 8 gig of ram it's the 8 gb of ram rgb ram i ordered this from aliexpress 266 megahertz and i'm using a sata to 6 pin power connector which will be used to give power to our graphic card so now let's just add this stuff in this so first step to add to graphic card is you have to open this okay so there were two same things over here i just removed them so i can fit my graphic card inside so i will show you how will you do it. so guys to add your graphic card first we have to take our graphic card and place in that blue slot pci slot okay so now it is in the slot so i'm just going to push it okay so now it is in and i will just close this so now it is locked inside okay now uh, let's add our ram okay so there are two slots in this first one it is used by the 4 gb of ram now second one so make sure you add it the right way because this sign will be facing upward like this so first you have to open these as you can see these are some little clips okay so first you have to open those okay. then you have to place your memory inside and push it you will hear a click as you can see okay so now our memory is now logged in now our side had to six pin connector as you can see here so there are two SATA ports which are not used so i'm going to attach this to the SATA port like this okay just in and this will go here as you can see this is a six pin power connector it will go in here and you will hear a click here you go click okay so now let's just turn it now on. guys let's turn it on so one two three it is on so the fan is spinning as you can see rgb here and my graphic card fans are also spinning so it is a good indication that these all are working fine so now guys in my next video i'm going to show you that how can you set up your graphic card with your pc like how can you download the drivers and stuff so if you have enjoyed this video and is this video helpful to you Please give this video a thumbs up. I will meet you in my next video. Take care. Bye-bye.